coming out on me, are you? No, sorry, I was, uh... It's fine, it happens all the time. Well, look who's keeping the tooth fairy busy. Oh, you can say that, yeah. Shall we? Oh, sure. <clears throat> look, Mary. I know going to the dentist has got to be very frightening. But I assure you, we're no monsters. Speak for yourself. Oh, oh, <laughs> you. <laughs> oh, Sue. Mary. Mary, Sue. Huh. You know, Ma I just don't understand why I have to have my teeth pulled. They, they feel perfectly fine. Sure. <laughs> they feel fine now. But over time, those wisdom teeth like to shift around. And before you know it, you've got a mouth full of trouble. <laughs> Listen, Mary, dentistry's come a long way since the days when your parents got their teeth ripped out in the back of a barn. Oh, my parents oh. didn't. <laughs> Recent advancements in modern dentistry has rendered the process practically painless. A few tugs of this and you'll barely remember we had this conversation at all. It's like helping yourself to a nice bottle of wine. <laughs> or ten. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Mary, what do you say? Well, you know, I, I do have you. Oh, um, some deep breaths through the nose. How is that, Mary? Feeling a little woozy? <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, num num time. Okay, wide now. Wide. Good. Trick and up. You know, you have beautiful teeth. It's almost uh, <clears throat> sumptuous. Sue, you've got to see this. Right. How much do you give per tooth? Most give a nickel, some a dime. Uh, one lady went quarter per tooth. What a kook. Uh, 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 what? Uh, Sorry? I, I give ten cents. Oh. <laughs> okay. Very still now. Uh, have you ever heard the original story of the Tooth Fairy? Mm-mm. No? Mm-mm. Creepy stuff. All done! We're gonna give that a moment to set in. Anyhow... Originally, there were... Tooth Fairies were <clears throat> a sight different than the winged women we often think of today. Winghead. Is that a word? Anyhow, originally they were called Bone Groove. A mighty race of creatures that lived beneath the earth and feasted on the bones and teeth of the dead. They ate bones? And teeth. <laughs> See, uh, uh, when a child lost its tooth, a parent would bury it in the ground. Well, the Gru could sense it, and they were appeased. Sorry, Sue, can you give me a gauze? <clears throat> but eventually, the 
humans evolved and moved into cities. <laughs> so they no longer had ground to bury their teeth in. So they just put them uh, under their pillow. <laughs> the children loved it, and the, the bone grew could still eat. Seems like a lot of trouble to go through for some measly tea. It adds up. Relaxed? Whoops. Oh. Now there. <laughs> Lunchtime. Yes. She's up. Uh. All right. Ready to go? Mm. I have instructions at the desk. Call if you uh, have too much pain. Oh, and let's get that sun of yours in here. Sooner rather than later. Okay. <laughs> 